for this video just click on add overlay click on overlay and add overlay then select this image click on add i will give this link in the description just click on add now reduce the size according to your need put it wherever you want for this video i'm going to put it like here and a little bit like this then increase the duration of the image then click on add for, oh sorry sorry for the keyframe right here i'm going to be it just add a keyframe in front and in the back like this then search for basics and click on rotate and increase the rotation to one two or three or four x according to your need and it will rotate something like this now we're gonna do the same process with again add an overlay add an image then reduce the size put it whatever you want and then increase the duration like uh, uh yeah increase the duration like this and then add a keyframe right here and add a keyframe right here then going to click on search for basics and here and going to rotate to increase or minus according to your need where you want to rotate it like left or right if you do it minus it will rotate left if you do it plus it will rotate right like this now we're gonna do it same again and again like this i'm just increasing some speed because i want it to move faster like this now we're gonna repeat this process again so i'm going to skip this part okay click on add overlay again and add overlay and select the image or video you want for this video i'm selecting gojo's this image i'm going to put it like this and then increase the duration like here now here now search for mask and then click on circle increase like this like zoom in type increase the size and here it looks good to me right here just a little bit put it in the center like here click on ok search for layer and just drag it to the last like this and it will look some kind of this just do the same process with another image like whatever you want where you want just do it the same process right here so i'm also gonna skip this for because it's easy to do that so here you go i'm skipping this part So after that save your video because after doing that just click on save and increase the frame rate and code rate and click on export and it will export automatically then so guys this part is very easy just watch the video and follow the steps it's all about keyframes zoom in and zoom out so just watch and follow the steps so peace out